What is up guys? Um, so what we're covering today is essentially the TikTok email scrape. Um, a lot of, as you might know, uh, Google indexes a lot of pages and a lot of platforms. And uh, TikTok basically is like the major competitor to Instagram at the end of the day. And a lot of profiles, uh, depending you know upon what they include in their bio, a lot of like massively followed profiles generally include a certain email within their bio itself. So if Google indexes all the TikTok pages and all the TikTok profiles, sometimes it might pick up the email and include it in the meta description itself. If it includes it in the meta description, this means that we can basically roll out scrape box and we're able to basically scrape all the emails of these profiles, either for an influencer outreach or for some B2B offer or a certain B2C offer. Um, this does mean that you're outreaching to them directly via email, but there are a couple of TikTok automations out there on the market as well that you can basically utilize the outreach to them as well. Um, one is AutoTalker, but it's more of a profile grower, but I'm sure that if there aren't already in the upcoming months, there will be TikTok auto message bots that basically message a certain number of profiles to outreach to them. So then this means that the only thing that you need is the URL and you're essentially able to follow them and outreach to them. And the other segment, of course, is the email itself. So if you take all the emails, you bounce check them using something called the super email validator, um, just clean, check, bounce, check, etc., and then essentially save them. You're able to outreach to them through a wide variety of tools, including GMAS, Lemlist, etc. So you choose which tool is best for you. Um, on the aspect of Lemlist, Lemlist basically automates 100 messages per day, sending them as one by one with a timeout. Whereas Gmas uh, is a mail merge tool that just basically sends all the emails at once, right? With no timeout in between, or it's like a super, super small one, nothing compared to Lemlist. And uh, essentially makes every email seem as a unique send. Basically, if you pair it up with Amazon Sass as well, you can basically send up to, I don't know, 10,000, 20,000 emails per day at the end of the day. But with regards to this scrape, um, pretty cool and pretty simple. The main tool that you need essentially is Scrapebox. So that's number one, scrapebox.exe. And uh, the search query as well. So essentially we want Google to give us all profiles that are within this site. So www.tiktok.com dash at dash at is the initial extension of any profile. And then we want to make sure that it includes at gmail.com and health. And I'll show you how to expand on this query right now as well. And how to include all the emails as opposed to just Gmail. But essentially the way it works is in the following manner. So site.com just paste this right here we want to make sure that it includes more emails and then we'll remove the niche locator itself and then this is one of the latest scrapes that we did and basically what this is telling google to do is to pull up any profile that is on tiktok and has this site url itself and uh that the profile either includes an at gmail.com or a at hotmail.com or a yandex.ru, which is a Russian mail provider, or an iCloud.com or a yahoo.com. And it's in the brackets as well because it's you want to basically just organize it so it's not all over the place. And the or is basically give me this or that essentially. And then here in the keywords, you basically include the niches that you want to target. So in this case, we'll do health, then yoga, then fitness, then workout, then gym, then muscle, then etc. And this is basically an approach that can be used for an influencer outreach for any B2C brand out there or for just B2C sales if you want to risk it with regards to the emails. And then you essentially make sure that your proxy is on, you start harvesting and what you're going to get essentially is a bunch of search results that are re related to the search query that we've inputted right here. Make sure that you have a proxy on whenever you do this because Google can blacklist your IP, which essentially means you're screwed. And uh, yeah, essentially it's harvesting right now. So that's 148 URLs. I think it's going to yield anywhere from 500 to 600, maybe even less possibly 400. But essentially, as soon as you get the URLs, you then use Scrapebox's email grabber, which I'll showcase right now. Uh, you make sure that your like timeouts and your email grabber requests are the same as your proxy's concurrent requests. So in this case, 10 uh, with my scenario. 
And then essentially you start grabbing the emails directly from the URLs themselves, which I'll show right now. Just waiting for the URLs to load. And then you plug it into a super email validator if you're looking to do a, a manual outreach or an automated email outreach. And then, yeah. Basically, the most important thing to understand with regards to these scrapes slash growth hacks and just like data acquisition and enrichment tactics is that Google will essentially index a lot of stuff. That's what Google does. Google indexes TikTok, it indexes Instagram, it indexes forums, platforms, Facebook, etc. So as long as you have an understanding of what the site parameter is with regards to finding profiles, you can basically replicate this across any platform out there. You can use it for Facebook, you can use it for Instagram, you can use it for forums as well that actually maintain profiles and sometimes the profiles might include an email and they're niche oriented. You can literally use this for anything. So that's the literally the most important takeaway with regards to it. As soon as this is done, you plug it into Scrapebox, add your keywords, get the URLs, etc. If you want Scrapebox with a discount, there's a link in the description below. And uh, if you want a clear understanding with regards to these growth hacks, make sure to check out the growth hacking bootcamp. And if you have any questions, reach out to me on WhatsApp. But essentially, in this case, you remove the duplicate URLs, you're left with 447 results, and click on grab check, grab emails by crawling sites, start, and that's it, basically. Right now, what it's gonna do is it's gonna load up all the URLs and then start processing my request. So going into TikTok with a individual IP address, grabbing the emails and closing the case. The exact same thing happening over and over and over again. And then that's that. Once the emails are done, you plug it into Super Email Validator, this one, which is free. Um, I'll include the link to it in the description below and you verify them and then you're able to outreach to them and this bounce checks them in a free way so you don't need to spend like a thousand bucks on a thousand emails you do it all for free just make sure your port 25 is open if you guys have any questions comment in the comment section below and make sure to check out the links in the description thank you very much guys